Okay guys, I promised to show you a little video of cooking with a welder. Let's go do hamburgers, but I don't have any hamburger meat handy. You can do this with any meat. Well, let's see how this is going to come out. You notice, I have a stainless steel frying pan. And it is connected to the negative lead of my welder. A little bit of butter in there, just to keep things from sticking. There's mobile homemade welder. It's a half wave DC rectified. I've got it set on 30 amps right now. We're gonna see how this works. I may have to crank it up a little higher, but I think 30 would be enough. And of course there is the business end. It's connected to the stinger. Okay, in the next situation here, we have some ham with cheese in it. I'll turn that in the pan. And by the way, my hands are clean. I'm going to eat it anyway, so. <laughs> Alright. Here we have our spatula. Also stainless. Notice I used the insulated handle. And also wrapped some electrical tape around the handle itself. That's just a little added safety so that I don't touch the sides of my pan and arc it up. Well, let's see how this goes. Very carefully. I'll lay it on top of the meat. Now we're going to try to keep from touching the side. Oh yes, baby. 30 is almost too much amperage. Boy, she gets hot quick. You talk about a way to make a grilled cheese sandwich. I just sprinkle a little water on it to make it conduct better, but wow, that gets hot quick. Hehe, <laughs> and you got to keep a tight grip on it so that it does not arc. Otherwise, it will. And this being kind of an uncontrolled situation, I have to keep taking it off. And if you see an area that's not warmed properly, just move over to it. Look at that. Is that not amazing? Like I say, keeping a tight grip on it to keep it from burning the top for marking. And this is half wave DC rectified. So you can see. Ooh, ain't that neat. It cooks very nicely. Holding on there long enough, she will be sizzling. There, we have one ready to be eaten hot piece of ham and cheese. Hope y'all enjoy this one. This is Warren, another one of my crazy redneck ideas. We'll catch y'all later. Hope you enjoy.